So in this video, I'm going to show you how you can use AI to write IEPs, save yourself a lot of time and maybe even a little aggravation. Let's go ahead and get started. The website you're going to go to is magicschool.ai. This is a website that helps educators use AI to generate a variety of different content. Now it is free to sign up. So the first thing you'll wanna do is go right up to the top and sign up for free. So after you sign up, this is what Magic School looks like. You can see there's a number of different content types that you can generate using AI. The goal of this site is just to help make an educator's life easier. Now in future videos, I'll be highlighting some of these options, but what I wanna do is scroll up to the top where I have IEP suggestion generator starred or favorited, and that is for easy access because it is IEP season and I have to write IEPs for my students. I don't want to start from scratch, so I'm going to use AI to help make this a little easier for me. Now, before we begin, you can see some of the limitations over here to the right hand side. The biggest takeaway is please read everything closely before using this on an IEP. So, the first thing we do is select our grade level. I'll just say 10th grade. There we go. Okay, now disability category. I'm just going to say learning disability. And I'll even say learning disability, I'll just say reading on here. And now description of student behaviors, needs, and strengths. And now a description of student needs and strengths. There are a few. Now, the more information that you put in this description, the better the output is going to be. But I'll just leave this the way it is. And now I'm going to select generate. And in just a few seconds, you'll see magicschool.ai generate what could be an entire IEP. So at the top, you can see it starts with the present levels of performance. It leaves a little space for you to add the student name in later. It shows the needs and impact of their disability. And then we get into the section with goals and objectives. You can see they leave a number of measurable goals using written in the, in the smart goal format, as well as some modifications at the bottom. So I know a lot of special educators use uh, or Google different IEPs or Google comments or goals or get suggestions that way. This hopefully will make it easier because I know it is a huge challenge to write a IEP from scratch. Now, after this is finished, what you can do is click copy and then paste that onto a document where you can really read this very closely add more, maybe remove some things or, or take big sections out. Or if you're just looking to get an idea of a suggested IEP, you could read this and then start writing from scratch. But the big takeaway with using this site is to please make sure that you read everything closely. What you don't want to do is copy this, paste it into a document and maybe add the student name and then call it a day. You really want to think about what's on this document. But again, the goal in using this is to save you time to give you ideas of potential goals and really just to make your life easier and focus on the needs of the students that you support. So the website is called magicschools.ai. You'll be able to generate IEPs in seconds, which hopefully will serve as a rough draft for your final IEP. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below.